Hello folks, welcome back to Oxygen Not Included. I'm Absurdities. We're here with the Death Gang. We're just Death Gang. And uh, we're going to carry on building up this base. Uh, for the moment, we need to get some more research in and continue to just set things up. And a farm is going to be on the list of stuff pretty soon as well. Uh, this space is going to be about the size for a ranch. We'll put a ranch here. We'll probably put a farm underneath it. Uh, but I want to get this water moved over. So, yeah, we're going to let them do their thing. Let's speed it up a little bit here. Thank you very much for the kind comments and uh, support for starting a new run. I appreciate that. And uh, I'll do my best to have this one go a little longer. But I'm, I'm feeling... I uh, know. I love this game. I've played it more than any other game. And uh, I will continue to play it. Probably forever. <laughs> I can't imagine a time where Oni loses its its fun. Um, you know, sometimes starting over is part of that fun. Anyways, we're good on oxygen. Food, we gotta definitely keep an eye on, but uh, we're gonna go get some more... Uh, what is this? Muck root. And we're gonna find more stuff in the process here. Uh, this is good to go. Let's put a floor there. And yes, it's technically a new day. Uh, we got some skills to assign to Dundas as well, who came in. Uh, we're going to immediately give you an improved tinkering hat and skill set. And I already messed with the priorities to uh, get him on operating there between episodes as well as do a little bit of planning. I think the bottom of the base will be about here. And we'll put uh, coal generators probably way down the bottom or maybe here and then see what we can do about uh, ice, uh, insulating the bottom. Um, yeah, I want to do some mushrooms down there again, but we could do that wherever we want, really, as long as we have the carbon dioxide to do it. All right, well, dupes, do your thing. I also did go ahead and adjust the schedules just now. And uh, I, I put them a little earlier and gave them an extra hour of downtime. I don't think that's going to hurt anything. We'll lose a little bit of labor, but we have just picked up two new dupes in the last, you know, few cycles. So uh, it's easy to remember. It's only cycle 10, so whatever we're going to set up now should last a while. And I was just more comfortable with that. So that's what we're going to do. Um, can we prioritize that, please? Thank you very much. And we'll get ready to dig this out. There we go. Let's get that water moved. You know, whenever you're ready. <laughs> so that's nice. We'll have some Sweetles over there. Nice bit of Oxalite over there here as well. Of course, we got that. And we can't really see anything new. I do want to continue going down as well as they figure their stuff out. Uh, but we do have the research happening, so that's going to be kind of important. There's Dundas working on the wheel. Perfect. 30,000 kilocal is pretty good. There we go. There's that water coming down. And that will be a nice uh, carbon sink, carbon dioxide sink down here, a well, if you will. And we are going to dig out all of this. Uh, we may have troubles doing that through here. Yeah, I think, uh, you know, I think we'll just go ahead and allow them to build that whole bit. Release! Release the Kraken! Yeah, 
as we've dug up here, I can already hear the meteor showers. Yeah. So again, it seems like we're fairly close to the top. I'll be interested to see if we have one or more AETNs in this run. I certainly hope so. And we are just about ready to mop up this stuff. We'll let this layer drain a bit more. There we go. Beauteous. And up we go. I suppose we might as well go right up to about there. Oh, we missed we missed a spot. Oh dear. Alright. Let's get that place down under there. And we're gonna dig out this layer to there. So what I've kind of planned for. One, two, three, four. I could have done something a little different in terms of structuring, but uh, I figure just a 96 long room. Now this is 96 here, but we're also going to have um, an extra tile for the ranch. So that's why I dug out that, that little corner there. That's not a mistake. At least not yet. We'll go something like that. Hopefully they can build that. I think they can reach that. Yeah. 92. No. No. Have I messed it up already? forgot about the uh, the doorway 96 plus one sleepy dupes sleepy dupes food poisoning gosh well that's unfortunate now let's see here. These are prioritized. We should have someone who's going to be cleaning. Yeah, perfect. Perfect. And I'm still waiting for polluted water to come out for the first time. And look at that. Just nice full water reservoir that's going to keep the temperature nice and regulated in here for the time being. And over here, hopefully the germs are kept down by the radiation. So, and that will be better when we reveal the top of it as well. And dupes won't be working in there for so long that it really matters. We have refinement. We do. Got compost. Right there. We throw a rock crusher in. I'm not sure where I'll do that. Maybe I'll just do it right here. And then the... I'm not sure how much heat it produces. Rock crusher. Yeah, it does produce some heat. Oh yeah, we can't put it right there. That's a good reason not to put it there. We'll put it underneath. And this guy is only just keeping up with the amount of oxygen we're using, so I think we're going to double up. One on the other end here. Otherwise, we're going to run into issues. I want to pressurize this space pretty well. No, right. Yeah, I gotta raise the roof on this. And dig it out. So, 64 tiles is to there. That will be like so. We'll build the top first. Uh, or not. Hello, priority seven. Oops, if I drag over the right thing, build that out, please. A 
would like to seal up the room. Sometimes playing at uh, the max speed is not in your best interest. Uh, simply because it seems like the dupes get confused while the game's trying to catch up to whatever's happening. Let's see. I don't think we're going to take a sixth dupe, or are we? Let's have a look at them. Uh, farming, undigging is decreased excavation, but that's not too bad. Increased cuisine, chef dresser, no. Decreasing hoard doesn't really bother me that much. Um, the decreased morale bonuses do bother me, though. Air consumption rate... Hmm, they use twice as much air. So 200 grams a second would be, I believe. But that is digging, cooking, operating. So here's the question. I need to decide whether or not we're just going to take the hatchling or we're going to re-roll another dupe and go for six right away. After a moment's consideration, we're going to go with another dupe. So let me find someone. And I'll show you who we come up with. And it really only took the one re-roll. Nothing's changed here. I think we're going to take Camille here. Iron Gut. Increased constru construction is kind of neither here nor there. But uh, we could possibly make her uh, a digger as well. Uh, digger slash constructor. I usually pair those two together. But uh, operating and tidying. Just another good all-around, uh, you know, handy dupe. I think we're going to go with that. Welcome, Camille. That puts us up to six. And we have five bets. So, uh, we also have some granite. Let's just throw those in and then we'll replace the sandstone ones. That's how that'll go. Of course, we need to get the skill. Camille, I think we're going to start with the strength. We'll give you the improved strength thing. We go into priorities, Camille and operating and I think supplying will be the way to go for her and Dundas you don't need a double just a single priority that's fine did I give her her hat yes okay make sure you get these beds please duperinos There we are. Now we have the extra bed. Another skill point. Player X. Uh, extra two strength. That sounds good to me. And we'll give you the plumbing hat. Speed 2 starts to seem slow to me, but I think, uh, I think it's best we stick with it. Alright, they got the room sealed up at least. That's nice. Camille's gone to bed. Camille's probably on the wrong schedule, but uh, yeah. Camille. And I think we'll move Dundas down to the bottom as well. And there we have it. Back. Let me look here. We got uh, Nunda, Cell Regis, Gihondo, Legon, Player X. I don't think I'm missing any one of the supporters. Uh, if you're considering supporting the channel, know that you will get your dupe right away. That would uh, certainly help me as well. Supporting by means of uh, YouTube membership or Patreon, which is the preferred method. No pressure. Just out there if you want to. All right, let's keep moving along here and just, yeah, builds. 24,000 kilocal. We did pick up that food. Uh, these guys are doing wonders here. We could always take these away. Yeah, if we get a, if we get a pip come up early, that would be really nice because I would happily plant a, a bunch of wild bristle blossom in here or morph it into a space that's ideal for it. 
How many tiles do we have left here? Really, 18 tiles? Yeah. 18 tiles is more than is there. Or less than is here in water, I mean. Derp. It is time to set up a supercomputer, I think. I guess it's going to go in right there. And that will do. Uh, we could always look at moving the ration box somewhere else. Didn't really leave a good space to uh, set up a CO2 well for it. We could do it down here somewhere. Maybe put the... Uh, the room there. Oh yeah, and we can close this off, which I forget. I'm not used to having a research room. And uh, I did change research priority a little bit to go for the fire pool. Make things a little faster getting around, especially if we're exploring, as you do. Let's have a look at temperature here. Looks like we've got the edge of a cold zone there. And that is just neutronium. Okay, that's good to know. I think this time around I'd like to get suits uh, set up a little earlier. We could just do oxygen masks, which I've never used before. Um, I don't think it's going to be this episode anyway, so not really anything to worry about. But if you have a recommendation as far as that stuff goes, do let me know. Suits or oxygen masks. Made a little bit of a change here, uh, simply to get the room bonus and get the electrical stuff out of there. So we got the efficiency bonus on the laboratory now. We just uh, moved the wheel and uh, installed a jumbo battery for better efficiency. And we got some skills. Yes, research faster, please. Field research, research hat. Super duper hard digging or no, we'll increase your building efficiency for now. So don't expect to go super far from home for the first little while. Be nice to find out what this is, but not really super important. It's more the cold zones I'd be interested in because cooling is is key. And we might take a few minutes to clean up the base as well, a few cycles I should say, and uh, put them on high priority once we've got some of this digging done. I want to get a farm in. I suppose one thing I should do if we're going to get a farm in is actually planet like a farm, which generally do not have floors. They have farm tiles, provided I have them. I do. Something like that. Uh, we probably won't use them all at first, but we'll see. I think we'll do a combination of, well, maybe we'll just go straight for Bristle Blossom. I don't know. I feel like... I feel like it's a rite of passage. You gotta go for the, not the muckroot, the, uh, uh, the, the mealwood. That's what it's called, mealwood. Now I'm just checking the kitchen space. Maximum 96 tiles, so we could turn one of these long spaces into a kitchen as well. We could do that right here. I think that's a good idea. Instead of a ranch shall be and kitchen yeah, we really don't need to uh, dig out that wall crafting station what how have I never Use these, but I've never, I've never seen it to be honest. Uh, even in that old run, let's just throw it there. I'll see what can be made there.
Carbon dioxide is holding the polluted oxygen in, which I love to see. And the germs are, they're there, but they're pretty low. Pretty low slime load. We'll get a little bit more of that radiation revealed to interact with some of that. And that'll do. Building, building, building. Because we could put in a light right away. Um, maybe the coal will go down here. Yeah, why don't we do something like that? I think we need a builder dupe. Uh, so I'm going to re-roll for a builder dupe and go with that. And after a couple rolls, we've come up with Travaldo, who is digging, building, and iron gut. Yokel doesn't matter. Unapathetic doesn't matter. Welcome, Travaldo. Let's get you a hat right away. And we're going to get you digging. Hard digging. We just also got another skill. Um, let's see. Spice grinder we never did use in the last one. Probably don't need to use it this time around. Yet. Well, we are farming and we're not uh we're not yet ranching, so that's how we go there. Alright, more digging to come. We're now installing the fire pole, which we got researched. Uh, we'll do one on each side there. And maybe actually I'll do outside fire pole. So outside this side. And then the inside we'll use for the transit tubes later on. We're holding steady at 27,000 calories so that's okay I think what I might do is we'll put in one light which is under furniture uh, we don't have it yet we don't have it yet never mind um, we won't then we could I suppose move these guys down here but I'm gonna say no to that for now uh, we could consider setting up the kitchen, though. Just in case we get desperate. Uh, what are we going to do here? Just having a look at our options here. We got the egg cracker, of course. That'll do you there. Egg cracker, microbe musher. And that should be fine for now. We're still using the same default ration box which isn't my favorite but actually egg cracker and you are gonna switch a little more efficient in terms of materials and we don't use the egg cracker that often uh, we probably won't use the micro musher if I can help it Forever, 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 forever. And then we need to have a look at food in a minute, too. So we want to turn off eating raw meal lice. I know I just turn off the whole category. Uh, by double clicking or something like that. Yeah, or single clicking. There we go. Is it worth storing this stuff all the way down here? Maybe not. I am tempted to put it here. Um, then again, do we have a refrigerator yet? We don't. We could just go for refrigerators, couldn't we? Yeah. 
let's go for the refrigerators and ranching right now. And then furniture, we're going to need mess tables. How many are we going to need to house per mess? Well, we could do 16, but I think that's too many. That would be 12. I think, um, maybe we'll just make this place as nice as we possibly can down the road. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, of course, of course, right, because it's an uh, even number. We'll just do two banks of four. We'll put the, where is it, the water cooler in the middle, some statues, some pictures down the road. That'll be nice. New skill. Dundas with the operating. Electrical engineering. Twenty thousand calories. Let's get some achievements here. Outdoor renovations, bed and bath, and that was it. Construct a building outside the initial starting biome and have at least one toilet in the colony and a bed for every dupe. I've also decided now is the time to go ahead and clean up some of the stuff on the bottom before this hatch eats uh, any more than he has to. And uh, we're going to carry on just building out what we've got here. I'm um, keeping an eye on the calories. We're down to 17,000, but we are constantly pretty much discovering more food. Yeah, we'll probably dig in under here as well. And we had our first polluted water a little while ago. Forgot all about it, but uh, we've dumped it in here for now. And I'm going to make it so that we probably double up these layers. And then make sure the water flows to the left so that uh, the uranium can work its magic on it. So yeah, let's let, let some of this happen. Again, just a lot to do. Just takes a little time in the doing. And here's an interesting dilemma. Do we take another dupe, get right up to eight, pretty much right away? Or do we take some extra muck root? I mean, it's not going to last us that much longer. It's 4,800 kilocal. But um, I am really tempted to go with another builder. Let's have a look at our skills here, just so we know who's doing what. We have... Two base minders, really. We've got Camille and Player X, uh, who are going to mine base mostly. Dundas for operating. Legon and Trivaldo for building. So I'm, think I'm thinking of bringing on a third builder. Um, the one researcher is fine. And then the one cook. So I, I see a potential weakness later being in the farming and ranching and stuff. So maybe we need to bring in another dedicated farmer slash rancher. I think that'll probably be the way to go. But I'm I'm debating. I'm debating having the third builder because I like to build and dig a little faster. I'm going to take the risk. I'm going to take the risk. We're going to go for another builder. Um, you're okay, but I prefer not to have decreased athletics, so we're going to refresh and see who we can come up with. So after a lot of uh, refreshing here, we've come upon Gossman, who has suit wearing, digging, and building, but they are building and prepared. Pardon me for the, the thump there. Um, 
So that's a dis uh, construction minus three, but also building is plus three. So they kind of work out even. They're going to be a slower building builder, but I like the suit wearing uh, because uh, ideally it's going to be the builders who are going outside the base to dig and build things. So I think we're going to go with Gossman. I don't know. Let me know if you think that's a bad idea in the comments. Let's go. All right. Get you your skill. Gossman. And I think we're going to throw it right into building right away. So that we offset some of that initial penalty immediately. And we'll get them working away. Let's get their priority set. Gossman. Building and digging, please. And you'll be attacking as well. So, that'll be interesting to see if we can keep up with the food production. Of course, we have no food production yet. I think it's time we did plant some mealwood, though. Let's go with... Uh, probably... That many? I don't know. A bunch. We could do mush bar... No, not mush... Fried mush bars is what it would be. Can you not make them anymore? Maybe not. Pickled meal is kind of terrible, but kind of fine. So that's kind of what we'll go for. We already have that set in the foods. So we're good to go. We just need our farmer to farm. Farming, ranching, cooking. Yes, Regis, you should be doing it. And he is. Good, 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 good. Hopefully we can get some of this stuff cleaned up pretty soon, too. I'm going to put a pause on building after uh, this stuff is sorted out and digging. Mm, 95, no effects. What do we need in there? Oh, we need the spice grinder, I believe, for it to count as a proper room. Proper kitchen spice grinder, yes. And a refrigerator, which we do now have. So we're going to throw that in there. I want to store everything, please. Priority eight. This will be... We'll just turn down the priority and they can move it. There we go. Uh, deconstruct, please. Then we'll move this guy over. How's the light go over here again? Better this light bulb thing. I should really have these switched. But I think they stand on the middle tile, so it may not matter. Looking good. Okay, let's rebuild that now. Yes, missing research station. I know. Two science buildings and a light source. Be beautiful. That counts. Amazing. It's almost like they thought ahead with that. All right, lots of dupes doing the storing now. We'll probably run for a few cycles like that while this stuff is growing. Yeah. Uh, maybe I'll let them clean up between episodes, actually, because we're looking like it's about that time. So I will bid you adieu. Thank you for watching, everyone. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Special thanks to Patreon members, Patreon patrons and YouTube members. Uh, please consider supporting the channel in that way if you can. Uh, and do subscribe, which is free and easy and uh, necessary for me to become that official YouTuber status at uh, 1,000 subs. All right, that's all I got. Have a great rest of your day. Again, I think I said that already. I'm, I'm getting repetitive, aren't I? All right, goodbye. <laughs>